Hey there, this is Al. Um, okay, so I'm gonna get try to get this car running. Um, it's been a while. It's been a very, very long time since I got it started. Um, and, uh, and I want to see if I can get it going because I, I said it was running when I was having a conversation with a potential buyer. Um, so what I've done is just to help it along, I've added a little bit of a, um, a gas into the intake. Um, as I mentioned before, the, uh, um, the, the car would run, but the, I think the accumulator is bad, and as a result, it just wouldn't build up fuel pressure. So what I'm doing is I'm effectively adding fuel to the system, which should give it enough juice to keep it running, and then it should be able to run by itself of its own accord, um, assuming that the fuel system isn't bunged up again, but we hope. Anyway. Oops. Horn works. Is it? Okay. Let's see how long it runs. Okay, it's running. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put this back on. This is the air cleaner. So there you have it. It's a um, 2.8 liter straight six engine. As you can see when it runs, it does does seem to run okay. Not bad. Not horrible. Um, pretty smooth. So it's not really missing or anything else like that. Um, as I mentioned, it's got the sanding compressor. The Euro car, so it's got the dual manifold, you know, uh, three and three. Um, I think, if I remember correctly, I did replace the plug wires as well as part of this whole uh, uh, process, but it's been so long. Um, so the plug wires should be pretty good. Um, so the compressors are sanding, but one of these hoses is so dry that I did try to add a little bit of Freon to see what it did, and, and it basically just leaked out, so you'll need to replace the hoses. Um, the linkages are really stiff. That's kind of my big problem with this car. Um, I'm actually surprised because it's not blowing that much smoke or anything else like that. Um, which, you know, you'd think it might do because it sat so long. Um, neutral safety switch is bad on this thing. So it'll crank and start in first gear, I mean in, in neutral, but it won't do it in, in part. Okay, there you go. Oh, did I kill it? Yeah, I killed it. So obviously it hasn't warmed up. Power steering works. It's got the manual climate control, which you typically expect from a Euro car. Uh, doesn't have a rev counter, which you'd expect from a Euro car, because they came really with barely anything. It does have a sunroof, and uh, has crank-up windows, but leather seats, so go figure. Air conditioning, sunroof, crank-up windows, leather seats. That's uh, the power of European cars. Give it a bit of wetty, it does, it does go. But that's it. So, um, I was true to my word, it does run. Okay, thank you.